so the first thing you notice is this cute little map that we got last year it says home sweet home it's from target my door is like an orangey tan color the cool thing about my apartment too i've never had this before you have this little like electronic key entry so i take my fob this is what my fob looks like and you go like this and you just turn it and you open the door but to lock it you also do the same thing so to lock it you would just go like this super easy super cool never had anything like that okay so when you come inside oh, who do we have here who do we have here hi baby say hello to the viewers no you don't get to chew on the keys this is my little shih tzu Callie. i just got her recently i have a whole last story time about the scam that i got her from and i'm so fucking thankful she's alive to be honest so if you want to hear that story let me know i will definitely share it in a future video but this is my new puppy and she makes the place so much better hi kelly oh <laughs> but this is what you see when you come in it's very very simple you guys i have a very very much smaller apartment than I've really ever had. Maybe my first apartment was the smallest, but this was going from a two bedroom to a one bedroom. So this is what you see when you walk in. You literally have this huge open space, which we need to get a dining table for this, but it's also not that big. So I'm kind of stuck. Like, do I want a dining table? This is what the door looks like. It's a big white door. So I have this little closet right here. This holds my jackets and things, but this is honestly an extension of my closet. So here I have a bunch of like sweaters and bigger jackets that won't fit in my closet. I have some of my Christmas pillows up there and some extra pillows and my backpack. And then down here is some extra shoes, my vacuum and Poshmark stuff. And then you come over here directly and this is my work area. So I have my ring light right here. I have my headphones right here that I use to work out with. I have a lot of my tax receipts and my YouTube tax stuff here because we have to pay quarterly taxes every year. And then I have this little chair that I've had forever. <laughs> it just has this like print. I really need something new to be honest with you. Yeah, this is what I'm using for now. I'm not out here being rich and bougie. I kind of just use the same things. I don't buy a bunch of new stuff because I'm not super rich and bougie. I'm just kind of like using what I have and my apartment is simple. I don't feel the need to over decorate. This is where I hang my purse, which is so cute. It's from Princess Polly. It's a little crossbody bag. I'm obsessed with it. I hang it right here so I can grab it on the go. We have a gaming mouse that we actually use for our computer and my lovely iMac, even though it is full of viruses and <laughs> I need help, okay? So I edit on here, I upload my videos on here. That's really all I use it for. I'm pretty much on my phone for the most part. Other than that, I have this amazing candle. Woodwick candles are everything. They sound like a fireplace kind of and they flicker like one. Seb got me this at Raging Waters when we went to the water park, this little Olivia surfboard. And it was honestly really special. It was kind of like a really good day and he bought it for me to be sentimental. I have my plaque right here. This is my YouTube plaque. So thankful for you guys. Congratulations for over 100,000 subscribers. I will never forget when I got this so I keep that just to keep me motivated and have it in my little work area because it just looks so cute like that I actually do have a little Bible here that I think my sister gave me and then I have my little pen cup right here I have my gold clock I've had forever and then I have this cute painting I think it goes so perfectly over my work area so I love that painting over here and then right here I have my robo rock which I actually haven't set up in this house yet and I'm so excited to use um, I think this is the perfect spot for it it literally cleans your house for you and then right here I have my mirror this is like a ten dollar mirror from Target Target. I need a new one so bad if you guys have any recommendations thinking about getting the one from Ikea That's like a hundred bucks. It's a lot bigger I'd probably move it right here and somehow fit it here I'm not sure and then move the rubber rock and then I just have my temperature gauge right there I have two little storage units. I keep towels and blankets in this basket It's super helpful because I don't really have a place for towels in my house where they fit well So I put most of my towels and blankets in here, but mainly towels So now let's look at the kitchen So right here when you walk in the only place I could find for the trash can is to go right there and then I have the fridge right here, which I totally miss my water and ice dispenser. I miss it so much, but it's okay. It's pretty nice spacing. Like I would say I can fit a lot of stuff in here. We don't really need to show you much of this either, but I have my cereal. I have my Atkins bars. I have peanut butter bread and then just like some extra stuff down here to cook. And I have some dog food and I have my toaster right here. I have my bananas. This little air fryer, you guys, it's from Bagot. Bagot, I'm not sure. You can make your frozen sweet potato fries, frozen fries and they're so good when you cook them in here. They feel like you got them from a restaurant. I just got this free product and I recommend it so 
much. I was really happy because in the other apartments they have like this weird like brown honeycomb type background but this one definitely fits the aesthetic more because it's only for like top level I think. So I do have really good views and I do have really good light which I love in this house. So I have my oven right here and then the stove top is really nice. This microwave is so great. I just bought these but this is like my woman's vitamins. I've never really taken vitamins and I would really recommend these. It's by the brand Ollie. And then of course my one and only Keurig. She is amazing and I have all of my coffees right here. I really don't drink any of them except for the Pete's coffee. It's the medium roast Nicaragua. I don't know how to pronounce that but this is the one that I love and I drink this with oat milk and almond milk creamer. So no dairy. I just pressed the ice button on my Keurig and I'm good to go. And then we have some storage down here, some stuff for the kitchen cleaning supplies. The sink is very big and what I love about this sink is it's actually a perfect place to wash your dog. So honestly I'm going to be washing Callie in here all the time. So you can just switch like this and go back. And then I have my paper towels right here. I have some decorations. Not to mention this decoration. Coffee in hand, big girl panties pulled up, sparkle in my eye, and a smile on my face. Yep, I'm ready for the day. Bring it on. This is so cute because this is a gift from my friend Victoria. She's actually an astrologer, and I'm going to be doing a video with her very soon. And she's amazing, so I will leave her links down in the description if you want to go hit her up if you have any questions or you want your chart read. So thank you, Victoria, for that. I think it looks so good in my kitchen. I have a really nice dishwasher right here. I really like the look of my kitchen. It's simple. So now, let's go to the living room right here <laughs> is Callie's area she will not eat kibble out of there the big nice dispenser that we bought her she only eats it out of this bowl right here she finally started eating again she was so sick so now she's eating all the time she's honestly gaining weight she's a little chunk and I love her so much the vet said she's supposed to sleep like 20 hours a day so so I feel like I'm annoying mom right now she loves this little water thing it purifies as it like refills in the bowl and she loves it she drinks so much freaking water and she loves when the bubbles goes up <laughs> we have this beautiful lamp here I got this from Target it's really nice I've always loved it we actually have a mood lighting bulb in here so I cannot wait I don't know when it's gonna be in the video but I'm gonna show you guys how my house looks with mood lighting which I've like never really done in a vlog or an apartment tour before so this has a special mood light in it you can change it to blue purple pink whatever you want and then we have her bed right here which we just got from PetSmart but we have a nice little blanket that's now designated as hers in there and we have her two favorite toys I decided to hang my three mirrors right here I really like the way that that looks right there and then you come over here I have my TV stand <laughs> And you know me, I'm watching That's So Raven, the best freaking show on Disney Plus. I 10 10 recommend you guys get Disney Plus. I decided to put this little flower piece from Target, they're fake flowers, um, on the side of the TV because it's just like too big and too in your face for the coffee table. And then we have this TV, which we actually plan on mounting, but I wanted to do the apartment tour before I was able to mount it. So let me scoot back a little bit. You could see that's gonna look a lot better when it's on the wall because the wall is so big and there's nothing on it right now. So this is my TV stand though, it's beautiful. Zeb put this together from scratch it was in like 5,000 pieces and he put this together and then I have the Xbox and then I have this little candle I've had for a while this is pumpkin walnuts and then I have this chalkboard that I've had forever I need to get chalk because I want to write on it I want to do like to-do lists on here inspirational quotes and then right here I have my little side table and then I have my Alexa Alexa what's the weather like in Anaheim Currently, in Anaheim, California, it's 69 degrees Fahrenheit. Now let's check out my coffee table. I also decided to go without a rug for now because my rug got so dirty in my last apartment. I just really thought it was unnecessary. And I kind of like the feeling of like wood floors since we do have carpet in the room. But this has a bunch of jewels and diamonds on the sides of my coffee table. And I love the way that this looks. It looks so bougie. I'm obsessed with it. And then I have my nice autumn harvest candle on there from Target. That's just my simple little coffee table area. And then I have my couch. Every Everybody asked me where I got this couch from. It is basically a bed. This part of the couch is literally a bed. So this is from Living Spaces. I have these little fur pillows from Target. And then these other pillows are from Target and Kohl's as well. And then this big long pillow, I think that was Sebastian's, I'm not sure. I really didn't mean to put it there. It's just there's nowhere else for it right now. And she loves sleeping on it when she sleeps with us on the couch. So I'm keeping it out here for now. And then we have this painting, which I'm so happy I can finally do something with. And it's just a picture of New York on like a cloudy night and all the lights are lit up it's so pretty I love the coloring the blue and the purple it's so gorgeous to me so it's just a cute little simple area and I have this blanket too which I forgot to mention is from Kohl's and it has little like glitter or sparkles in it gold sparkles and fringe right here and this is from like the Lauren Conrad line from Kohl's to go outside onto my patio there is this door and I'm not gonna show you a lot of the patio because there's a lot of stuff to be done with it um, I have a lot of storage 
Like you can see, we wanna donate this to a homeless shelter. It's just like some bedding and stuff. Sorry if it's really loud. I live on a very busy street, but we have these same patio chairs. We have the little plant right there that I got from Ross. And then we have this centerpiece right here with the succulent and the other chair. And then we do have a storage closet right here which carries a lot. So let me give you an idea of my view. This is kind of like what I see. This is like my favorite feature of this apartment. I have a full washer and dryer. It fits so much stuff in one load. You can fit like 50 towels in one load and it doesn't even look really like that. You literally just like press power right there and then it turns on and then you hold this start button for like three seconds and it starts and you like control the temperature and everything here. So we walk into the bathroom, it's not much you guys. And then I have a few essentials right here. I have my new Ariana Grande Thank You Next perfume. It actually smells really good. I have my Davinus hair product. I use this every day. This was recommended to me by my hair lady. And then I have two lotions right here because I love to keep my body lotion, especially in the winter when it's dry. And then I have my dry shampoo, toothbrushes back there, and my Tula skincare. This is changing my life. It's been helping my skin so much, you guys. Like, I'm not actively breaking out anymore. And then we just have the toilet right here. We have my nice little cute black trash can. I have my stack of toilet paper. And then we have some extras right here. And this cute little stay a while sign over the toilet, which I thought was so clever. And so did Seb. And so we were laughing and we put it up there. We just bought this curtain. I don't know if I like it as much as my last one because I don't like the quality of it as much. But the print is very nice and it's a nice contrast. And then you open it up and this is what I love 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 about my shower it's like a dark it's kind of like i feel like i'm in a high-rise apartment like in a bougie rich apartment this backsplash for the shower is gorgeous and then i have this home sign and then i have this laundry basket back here and i have my scale so this is where i weigh myself sometimes this is my favorite part of the house by far so we have this beautiful plush carpet. I don't know what it is about this carpet. I think it's so nice. It's very plush. We have this rug I have had forever. As you guys know, it's just this gray rug from Living Spaces. It was literally like $450. So we have this like fat, very wide walkway. This is Seb's side of the closet, so I'm obviously not gonna show his stuff. And this is the door to my closet. So I just have like one single door, but it does open up like pretty big. And this is actually a purse that I got from Princess Polly. Use my code, link in the description for 20% off. I will give you a little look into my closet. I have a lot of my shoes on the floor right here. A lot of my like bougie shoes or the ones that I wear all the time and every day. Sneakers, boots, snakeskin, leather, all the good stuff, heels. And then this is like kind of my rave drawer back here. This is like my rave cabinet. I don't know what I want to call that. And then I have some dresses, some jackets, and like all the shirts and sweaters and little things that I wear on a daily basis. Some regular dresses. I have my bathing suits up there. My rave backpack, some hats, and some belts and things like that in there. So this this is Sebastian's side of the bed and we have this little candle that's so cute. He has his little box back there that carries whatever he needs. We have this lamp that these turn on and these are mood lighting lamps. So I will definitely show you that in the video and it looks so good you guys. And then right above we have a dream catcher on his side. I thought that that would look really really good. We got these nightstands from Bob's Discount Furniture. So cute. We got the lamps from Target. I also got this bed frame from Bob's Discount Furniture. It's super nice. It's just sleek and black. And then we have this bedspread from Kohl's by Vera Wang. We have this cute little gray blanket I've had for a while that I got from my Aunt Nancy. And then we have these pillows. I don't remember where a lot of these are from, honestly. And then over here, we have our other mood lighting situation here. We have three different mood lights in here. So this really transforms the room. Okay, so this is the mood lighting that I have. And it creates like the best vibe. This is called Tokyo. They have presets. And this is Hue by Philips, I think. I got it from Best Buy. And this is like the Tokyo colors. So we have the three in here. And then we have these two lamps it's blue and pink um kind of obsessed don't know what else to say about it i'm gonna show you guys the other different presets as well you can do any kind of vibe what's the one that's like starry night or something that's my favorite other than tokyo Ooh, nebula look at the candle with nebula babe what is this Honolulu. Ooh. <laughs> And then we have these paintings right here that I used to have in my old living room, but I have nowhere to put them. So if any of you want them, let me know, or I'm going to find a place in the house for them. I just don't really think I need them anymore. So I have this huge dresser, which is also from Bob's Discount Furniture. And this is kind of like the TV stand now. It's the best place we could like fit it, and I think it looks really good, especially with the matching nightstands. I take up 90% of the drawers. <laughs> Seb has like a tiny little drawer. And then we have this little TV that my mom gave us. Our subscriber friend just gave this to us. I actually met her at VidCon, and then she came to my house to drop this off. She was so 
sweet. It says Olivia and Sebastian. I don't even know what those are called, but they have like little stars. It says June 16th, 2017, EDC at Cosmic Meadow. That's literally like the moment I fell in love with him was June 16th at Cosmic Meadow. That was the moment I fell in love with Sebastian. We tried to hang this up for like 20 minutes to go right here where the Bright Ideas work was, but we messed it up so many times we had to cover it with a bigger painting because there's so much marks on the wall. It's embarrassing. So yeah, and then I just hung this up today, this clock. I just did this freehand. I literally just like decided where a nail was gonna go. I nailed it in and I hung up the clock. I don't know. If you walk over here, this is a beautiful view, you guys. I love these windows. They like roll out so like your window like goes out and I will show you that in two seconds. You just go like this and it opens up and you get to see the world and it's amazing. I love the fresh air and city sounds, I'm not gonna lie. I have this princess chair, which I like to call, from Bob's Discount Furniture. This is my beautiful vanity area, and I got this vanity from Overstock or something. I don't really know, I'll have to find out. I got this little chair with it too. I love the aesthetic of this bedroom. I have this mirror where I actually apply my makeup. I have some jewelry right here. I have all my makeup, and I have my brushes, and just some extra little side things, my lashes. So then we have this, decoration right here. It's pretty much like a mirror, I guess, but it's also just kind of like a decoration. Looks really good in the room because the side of the wall is like so big next to the window areas. And then my nightstand area has this nice candle, beautiful mood lighting lamp, and then all of my glasses. So I put my prescription glasses right here and I put my sunglasses right here. And now I want to show you this. I'm not really sure what happens with the light side, but this is the window side. So this is like the window shade or whatever. Well, actually, let's press the down button first your shade comes down. So you can be on your bed, closing your windows so that the light doesn't come in. And then you wanna bring it back up, you just press the up button, and it slowly goes back up. So that is some bougie shit, okay? So yeah, that's kind of my bedroom as a whole. Showed you everything, showed you the nightstands, the vanity, the outside, the window shade, this cute little area, my closet. Hi baby, what you doing? Hi. You know, we almost named her Darla, which would have been just as cute, <laughs> honestly. Look at her little wet beard. That's what happens when she drinks water. I do not want her to grow up. Like, I'm a dog mom. I'm a mom now. I understand what people mean when they don't want their kids or their puppies to grow up. They're just so damn cute. Let's go. Come on, come on. <laughs> oh my God. She literally only runs for you. Good job, baby. Good job. <laughs> yes, <laughs> so oh, it's a good little puppies. Come on. Oh. 